Steelers, winning four Super Bowls, and battling back from those injuries he suffered. I was fortunate to make a trip one time to Walter Reed Hospital and meet with some of those wounded, and I, I hate to call them kids, but that's what it, it seems like, how young these people are that are sacrificing their lives and their bodies for our country. And to know that what Rocky did, and for so many to know his story, what an unbelievable inspiration that man is in fighting back. And with that being said, I've got a good friend of mine. Where's Adam? Adam Alexander? Adam Alexander is a very good friend of mine. I was fortunate to embed with his unit, the 432nd Civil Affairs Battalion in Afghanistan. Adam had a little bit of an issue one day. I'm just going to describe what happened that one day, Adam. Well, I, I got in the way of a AK-47 round, kind of tried to headbutt it. And I learned afterwards that incoming fire should always have the right of way. <laughs> what did the doctors tell you? They said that I had about a 5% chance to live, but I've never been very good at math, so... <laughs> Lost an eye, and I wish he would have worn his artificial eye here, because he wore it to one of the Packer games I had him at, and instead of a pupil, it's a Packer logo. Yeah, I can't see out of the damn thing anyway, so you might as well have fun with it. <laughs> but that's what Adam has battled back from. Basically had your skull rebuilt with plastic or something? Titanium. Titanium? It's hell to get through the airport. But... I'll bet. So with that in mind, I would like to present the first of what we hope is annual Rocky Blyer Fighting Back Award. This award is given to a military veteran who, while wounded in action, has fought back with a type of courage and determination that Specialist Blyer showed in recovering from his wounds suffered in Vietnam in 1969. Our recipient is an Army veteran who was wounded in action in Afghanistan on 10 November 2011. While suffering life-threatening and life-altering wounds, he not, only of, er, he not only persevered, but has recovered in awe-inspiring fashion. We're extremely honored on this day, September 22nd, 2022, to present the Rocky Blyer Fighting Back Award to U.S. Army veteran, veteran Adam Alexander, 432nd Civil Affairs Battalion. Rocky. <laughs> Thank you, Adam. Thank you. Got it, buddy. Good to have you here. Got it. One more round of applause for Adam Alexander.